Just forget our conclusion. I don't know why <laughs> I don't have a boyfriend. That's our conclusion. I don't, we don't know why Misa does not have a boyfriend yet. Hi! Hello, hello. Hello, hello, and welcome back to another video podcast of Misa Yuka Podcast! <laughs> We're so good at that now. You know. Yeah, we've like practiced three times and we're so good. So I think we crushed are crushed it. We just crushed it. <laughs> we are professionals. All right. Okay. Well, today we would like to talk about we have a really juicy topic right today and we are going to be talking about relationships. Relationships. Ooh. Ooh, having like a girlfriend and a boyfriend, having your love of your life. Oh, yeah. Whoa. Because <laughs> this was, like, actually a really interesting topic because why, Yuka? Wait, why? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I don't well, know. like, everyone, like, it's, right. like, it's everyone, like, relatable. I think, yeah, it's relatable. Everyone loves to talk about relationships. Yeah. And I've actually have never had a boyfriend before in my life. Right. So, boyfriend counts. Misa, yeah. zero. zero. Yuka, three. Three. Well, but like the first one doesn't really count. Yeah. Yet, so like two. <laughs> yeah. Okay. It's funny because I don't really talk about this with any of my friends either. Right. Yeah. Like relationships are like the last things I talk about with any of my friends. Yeah. We don't um, even talk about. Yeah. We don't talk about like we, love and stuff yeah. either. Like boys, I can really talk about. Mm. Yeah. So this is going to be interesting because I'm not used to talking about all of this. <laughs> yeah, I'm really curious to like hear why <laughs> why <laughs> why you're not interested in like relationship. Yeah, you I know? don't know. i like I think it's how like we were raised maybe. Don't you think so? <laughs> how were we raised? Cuz like our like mom is like she's like a f- interesting like funny mom and she remember like she used to be like in like like, until you get into college, like, you shouldn't be, like, having a boyfriend or something. Right. Well, you had, a, you had a boyfriend, like, in high school. No, I didn't. Oh, really? Yeah, it was, like, more of, like, a summer. Oh, like, summer, summer after high school. In, yeah. Summer going into college. Into college. Because, okay. okay, like, you had a date for prom and stuff. Yeah, but that yeah. wasn't, like, dating. Yeah, no. that's true. Yeah, so, like, I feel like... You know, I think we were just too busy studying. Yeah. Yeah. Studying in the States is crazy, but yeah. people still like, you know, have boyfriends and stuff. Yeah. And girlfriends like in high school. Yeah. Like high school love. I think that's really cool. It's really cool. But like, I, I just like, we just never had the chance, I think. Yeah. Yeah. And, and then, it's fine. Yeah. And it's fine. I was like so happy. Like, <laughs> or like, I wasn't even thinking about that in high right. school. So, and I then think- once you're in college, like you're not even thinking about that, that either. For me. <laughs> <laughs> and then, like, you graduate college, and then, like, here I am. And then you're, like, yeah, out in the social world. Yeah, out in, yeah. And so. For society, and then, like, not having a boyfriend <laughs> still. Still, man. Okay, so. Yeah, well, like, I think, like, that's how we were just raised. Or, like, for me, and then it was, like, if you. It was, like, like, mom was, like, oh, you know, like we were so busy studying mm-hmm. and like getting into a good college and stuff. So like, maybe it's like a typical Asian thing. I don't know. I think it is a typical Asian thing, really? but um, it also depends on like our personalities and like, I mean, people still like people can, I don't know, you know, do both. They can do relationship and study at the same time. Yeah, I, I don't think I can do that. Yeah, so I don't think we're just like those types of people. Yeah, it'll be really like really difficult for me to focus right <laughs> yeah it's like so i can't focus like even if i'm alone <laughs> you know like i can't focus on so many things <laughs> okay so who what like okay so if you were to have a boyfriend mm-hmm. like who would be your type oh that's an interesting question because like i don't think i have a type do you have a type okay let's go with like physical okay looks, physical though. looks okay i think i like um since i i have like um, small like everything like small features Uh i think i like guys who have like a small feature so like bigger eyes like more so than bigger eyes i think i like 
skinnier, like longer eyes. Yeah. And like, um, like nose wise, like tall, like yeah. slim nose uh -huh. and like the jawline. Oh yeah. Yeah. The jaw like, kokkaku, kokkaku, yeah. Uh -huh. Like that needs to be like really defined, you know? Right. So we want a defined person. Oh, you have the same type <laughs> as me. Literally the same. This is very dangerous. <laughs> like, Long eyes. Well, mm -hmm. I, don't, I don't really, like, um, care about the nose. Mm -hmm. But, like, jawline, long eyes. Mm -hmm. And, like, yeah. It's just, like, like, just, like, a defined. Yeah. Person. Yeah. I think I like that. And um, they look cooler more so than, like, cute. Yeah. Yeah. Cutesy. Yeah. I can't. I, think, I can't do cutesy. Yeah. I think. I think that's, like, like physical. What about, like, do you care about, like, how tall they are and stuff? Or No. Yeah, me either. As long as they're, like, taller than me. Yeah, or, like, how muscular they are. Like, do you oh, care? I feel like I would want them to have, like, a like a healthy body. Yeah. No, they don't have to be, like, super muscular. Right. But I want them to, like, you know, be healthy. Like, healthy looking. Healthy looking. Right. Like, not, like super skinny yeah or like super muscular like yeah you know, so like just like the good just like a good balance yeah good balance people okay okay what about like personality wise like what is your type with like personality oh i think like um someone who i can be like best friends with okay like easy like a to good talk partner to. yeah yeah easy to talk to easy going um they're like fun to be around with but you can also do like um like deep talks mm, yeah i think yeah i think for me like um humor but like not so try hard humor if that makes yeah. sense yeah like, they're not trying to be funny but they're just really funny. naturally yeah funny. naturally funny i like, see I, I don't like it when like guys like try to be funny mm -hmm. you know like yeah that's like not a track that that just like looks very desperate but um i think i was like so, yeah i hate try hard yeah try oh hard my god like, i don't know it's just like, like please <laughs> get away <laughs> just yeah. kidding you know I so like, yeah. i feel like i would like yeah not so try hard person who's like very natural mm -hmm. just like natural and then you guys naturally click yeah yeah and then you can talk about many different things mm -hmm. besides work and everything you can like talk about the smallest things that happened that day so basically like your best friend yeah everything yeah 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 i think like that's like personality wise just like laid back and not so try hard like a very chill person yeah a chill person but also really fun to be around with i think we have the same type oh yeah great <laughs> great we look we, we we have the same voice we kind of look alike and we have the same type <laughs> very dangerous that, that's crazy <laughs> okay yeah. well that's our oh, type yeah and then also like this the person who has like the same values or something yeah yeah I feel like value, having the same value, like, is the key. Yeah. So what do you think is, like, the most important in relationships? Communication. Communication. Or, no, well, like, what do you value the most, like, oh, in a person? In a person, yeah. Their values and, like, how they think. Oh, okay. So it's, like, more, like, values. Yeah. And, like, mindset and mm -hmm. stuff. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, I think same. Same, same. <laughs> Okay, I want to find something that's, like, different, you know? Because well, <laughs> I'm, like, by next year, we're, we're going to be, like, dating, like, the same no, we're, person. Yeah, we're, like... And that's, like, not okay. <laughs> we're, like, we're, like, uh, we're, like, dating, like, a twin. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that'll be cool. That'll be so interesting. What if we, like, date, like... Like a sibling, like brother sibling. <laughs> That'd be so weird. We're like dating each other. So weird. That would be so weird. Uh, okay. Like, what do you think is like really important in a relationship now? Like to keep a healthy, good relationship. Communication. Same, same. <laughs> <laughs> like, it's an. I feel like communication. Like it's it's easier said than done. Right you now. Yeah. Um, I feel like. I don't know, like, it's really hard to try to read someone's mind. Mm -hmm. And so, like, I can't, I can, like, I cannot read anyone's mind. So, like, I, I hate Guess it. Guess what? Me person, either. Yeah. <laughs> but I hate it when, like, the other person's like, 
well, why can't you tell from my, like, like my situation? Right. It's like, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, that's so true. Yeah. yeah, communication and I think, like, like te- tempo, like, temp- tempo, do we say in English? Like, like rhythm? Yeah, rhythm. Tempo. <laughs> tempo. <laughs> Tempura. <laughs> <laughs> yeah like temp like like the rhythm like like the speed of that person what do you mean like i feel like um because i'm a really like fast-paced person like their lifestyle yeah rhythm? yeah, yeah. Oh, okay so like <laughs> like their like talking rhythm yeah okay. i don't know so like i feel like i would need like a similar or i don't know like maybe like ops i've never had a boyfriend so i don't really know <laughs> No, I feel like I feel like it doesn't really matter like um what kind of like lifestyle rhythms oh, okay. you have. I don't think it really matters. Okay. As long as like you respect each other. Yeah. A oh, respect is like a, a really important one Right. Too. Like even if you like, get really close to that person, even with like family too, like you still need some sort of respect, like yeah. boundaries. So like people like you have to be able to like yeah, respect each other. I feel like my like uh me liking someone comes everything comes from respect like Mm. respect and then for that person yeah for that person and then like like something sparks within me okay i see interesting wow (laughs) the spark (laughs) what about you (laughs) uh well that's really hard because like i don't really have experience but like but you've liked someone before right yeah i think so (laughs) you think so yeah i feel like it's Actually, I'm. I don't really like people very easily. Oh, yeah. Like that's like one um thing about me. Like, like even like friends, like probably, but like like nothing like sparks me like romantically. Like I'm not that, or like maybe like it's not. It's like, it's like um, it's like harder for me, mm-hmm, you know, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. to like spark something romantically because like before, if I because I think I. Th- think before i'm like okay if this is if this is going to get into like a romantic relationship right it's going to be kind of like um in japanese like mendoksai like um yeah like it's going to be too much work Mm -hmm. so i just like kind of let it go you know it's so funny how you can let it go so easily yeah i'm just like oh whatever like yeah like you're like you're you're not worthy of my life cut I feel like that's how your brain works. Yeah. I don't, like, you don't, like, bring in, like, positivity to my life. Or you don't, like, enhance my life. You are not needed. Yeah, like, I mean, I don't feel that way for friends. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, But, like, for, like, a romantic relationship, that can, like, that can go either way. Like, good Mm -hmm. or bad. And then I just, I think I just, like, don't have the time to, like, risk it. Right. You know, I don't even have the time to like, you know, you know, like take a shower every day. Yeah. <laughs> like, why would I have the time to like go into like a risky relationship when you're really young? But like when you're like over 30 and stuff, I feel like you like I think I would start thinking about like, uh-huh. you know, marriage and stuff. But um, like when I still don't have the time to like really take care for myself. Yeah. Like I just don't have the time to like be thinking about another person right Uh, romantically (laughs) like i really just don't like i really don't have the time (laughs) or i think i just my brain is like i don't i don't want to make the time either like i would rather make time for like dance and like i want to make time for like teaching kids dance or like teaching english to other people and helping them right um or like you know like working out or like finding the next best skincare products for myself you know right like i would or like making the best videos or something like you, you know? love like your free time yeah i think i mean like, like your time yeah i, I think i like to improve myself all the time yeah. so like if i had the time i would like start reading like books yeah that's like so different from me which is really interesting really yeah i mean i love like my time mm-hmm. but i also from my time i kind of like make time for others like a lot yeah, you make time for others. Like, I actually don't make time for others. Like, yeah, <laughs> you don't. Like, you would never see me in a social event. Yeah. 
you would never yeah. see her at a social event. Like, even though people, like, see me as, like, a really social person, like, you yeah. would never see me at a party. Yeah. Yeah, like, I – um although, so I said, like, I graduated college at – age 20 Mm -hmm. and so I couldn't even like drink at that time right right? at that point in my life so like I actually never went I think I only went to like one or two parties Mm -hmm. in like college which is like crazy because people party all the time in college you only went to one or two yeah wow I was like doing all my other stuff all the time yeah. Wow. And like people would throw parties at our house because like I lived with four other girls. Mm-hmm. But then I would just kind of like be kind of like in it, but not like drinking or like not actually partying. Wow, you know? you're like an anti social butterfly. Yeah, anti social, maybe. Because I don't know. It's just like um I think I get like tired easily, maybe. So yeah, so it's really cool that you make time for other people. I think that's how you um, gain and um, um, gain you. and nurture friends. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's, but I think um, my level of like making time for others is kind of toxic in a way. Really? Yeah. It like to myself. Mm-hmm. I think. I think I would just make. I prioritize my friends or, like, my boyfriends, like, more than I prioritize myself. So I kind of, like, drop everything. Really? Yeah, which is so bad. Like, I've realized how bad that is. Like, what do you drop? Like, I'll, like for example, like, um, like, I have to do – oh, like, for example, like, in college, like, I would have to, like, finish my, like, project, right? Uh-huh. And – I know that I have to finish my project, uh-huh. but I want to spend time with my boyfriend. So I would like spend time with my boyfriend until like 12 a.m. And then from 12 to like 5 a.m. I'll do like my projects. Wow. <laughs> wow. Yeah. I feel like I would do that if I really like to be with that person. Oh, I yeah. See. Like I wouldn't like I would get really mad at myself if I did that mm-hmm. with like a normal like friend like, right a person that you don't really yeah and <laughs> you care for i mean them. i care for but like um maybe like a person that i just met or like right. a person who like you know like you don't really ha- you don't have like a strong relationship mm-hmm. with yet mm-hmm. i would I, I would be really mad at myself if i did that mm-hmm. or i'll be mad at that friend <laughs> <laughs> You're such a bad friend. I'm, I'm like such a bad friend. Like I'll be like so bad at that friend. Yeah, but like for a person, if I really you know like enjoy uh-huh. being with, I maybe I would do that, and I'll be like, okay, I want to be with this person. So like I would kind of like do my, I will work extra uh-huh. hard, harder to like finish that project that I needed to do. I don't think so. Really, I feel like you'd be really frustrated. Like, because they're kind of, like, cutting in your lane. No, I would do that if I really wanted to. Oh, okay. Um, But then, like, if I really didn't want to. Or, like, if I, like, see mm-hmm. that thing that I needed to do more important mm-hmm. than that person or being with that person, yeah, I would definitely, like, do my thing. Yeah. And I'll be really mad at that person. Like, what, if, what, if, <laughs> what if, like, your boyfriend was, like, no, like, you don't need to do that. Stay with me. Yeah, I would be so <laughs> mad. <laughs> yeah, I think so, too. You'll be, like, pissed. I'll be like, okay, you go get your life. I have my own life. <laughs> Bye. Bye, we're done. Oh, my gosh. When Misa <laughs> cuts someone, it's, like, the scariest thing. She literally cuts you. Oh, gosh. Right. I don't really like if that person is really unhealthy in my yeah. life yeah i would definitely like i'm kind of like um i'm really like i'm kind of like i can just like do it very quickly yeah yeah but like but i think that's that like, like when i was really young too. though yeah. yeah when i was really like younger yeah. yeah like early like later like teens you know I think that's a really good thing, though. I really like how your light, or I mean, like, you have this, like, um, like core center. Mm-hmm. Like, 
this is me mm-hmm. this is my lane um let me walk in my <laughs> <laughs> let no. me walk in my freaking lane <laughs> like if, literally like, if shoot, someone shoot. tries to like kind of like like um you know bother your lane mm-hmm. you're just like no like this is my lane. <laughs> but i don't really like i'm not really conscious about that yeah you're not conscious yeah. but like um but you're, you also, like, don't, you don't hesitate. Yeah, but I'm not really conscious about my hesitation or, like, not hesitating <laughs> either. Yeah. So maybe it's, like, second nature to me. Yeah. Yeah. So she will never be in a toxic relationship. Yeah, I would never be in one. Like, I know myself yeah. too much. No. Like, I'm, like, scared I would not be able to marry. But I think marriage is a really beautiful thing. Yeah. I think love is so beautiful. And I'm really excited to have my first boyfriend. <laughs> <laughs> I'm excited to fall in love and like cuz I I read about this, I watch movies, and it's so cool. It's so what, exciting. What's cool about it? Like like being able to like love someone, you know, unconditionally like a dog loves you. Yeah. Like that's really cool. Yeah. So I think that's I think like love and marriage is like a really awesome thing. Mm-hmm. It's just like sometimes like we take it like commercially. Then in yeah. media, it's like you know it's like shown differently. It's like portrayed yeah. differently. Um, it's yeah. like more of like a nantino kind. It's like um, like I don't know. Which one? Which kind of like relationship do you want to be like? Do you want like phys- like attraction? You know, mm-hmm. or do you want to like uh? I think I like this person. I don't know. Maybe I think like, like attraction. Because <laughs> no, 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 no. I don't. No, 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 no. Uh-huh. That's like, like wasting time, no. you know. Like. <laughs> okay, okay. Or like, uh, <laughs> it's like not like instant attraction, but like you feel comfortable being with that person. Oh, okay. <laughs> Okay, <laughs> if I like him or not, that's just wasting time. Like, yeah. if you like him, you like him. Okay, if you yeah. don't, but like you like him, but like you like each other, but it's mm-hmm. not like, like, instant attraction. Like you have like so much like, um, you know, like you know, doki doki. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I think I would like the latter. Uh huh. Like the oh, if I do I or like what is it? It's like I'm. I feel so comfortable being around this person. Uh-huh. I like. I like this person, but we don't have like this like natural like physical like attraction. You know those like attractions yeah. like you see someone and like you instantly click. No. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> like, I just don't... the wrong person. Okay, just imagine this in a movie. Okay, uh-huh. like Ken and Barbie, they have this instant, instant click, right? Okay. And they like you know really like each other, so then they spend like. Um, a lot of time together afterwards mm-hmm. but the other one is like you like click but i don't know you don't have like this like i love you uh, you know like instant oh my yeah. gosh i love this person yeah you're like oh, i don't like yeah. it's really comfortable being around i'm really comfortable being around this person i think that's like more fun which right one? which like one? the latter like oh i like this like this person is really comfortable yeah like being with like i feel like instant like attraction is really nice too but it really depends on that situation yeah but i think like it's like fun to be like oh my god this person is like really comfortable to be with blah 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 yeah you know i think that's really like fun fun even situation. though like the latter one takes like a while i think yeah in order for that to become like a real like loving relationship like love relationship yeah um i feel like those types of relationships last longer yeah I'm not, yeah, maybe. Maybe. <laughs> Her maybe. answers are maybe. Maybe, I think. Yeah. Perhaps. Perhaps. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah. I would like to be in those types of relationships. Yeah, I think that's like more realistic, too. Like, instant attraction is like a really, like, you're saving a lot of time for yourself, but like, sometimes you're like, oh, like, like, it's too fast. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe like growing, your, growing like a friend relationship first yeah. and then get into like, a romantic relationship that's like better yeah i'm not really sure but yeah, that's how i think yeah i feel like my last relationship was more of like attraction yeah and then like the one prior to that was like 
um, slow, like the slow, like let's get to know each other. Uh huh. And that one lasted really long. Yeah, I think that's like that's like really fun. Like、mm-hmm. in the process of getting into that romantic relationship, like you're having a lot of fun. Yeah, you know.、Um, yeah, yeah. And then you want yeah. So I think that process is like what I would like. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's true. Interesting. Hmm. Hmm. I'm just like I don't know like any of the answers, so this is just an interesting talk. <laughs> <laughs> What about?、Um, how do you think you would handle like um uh like an argument? Like an argument? Yeah, if you got into an argument. Uh huh. While be- while in a relationship, yeah, <laughs> your, your face. Well, I'm you're, always right. You're like, so <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> um, I know you're always right. Just kidding. I'm not like I feel like um I'm just like a really bad listener. You know?、Oh, yeah. Yeah. I'm like I just don't. I'm just always talking all the time. Yeah. So like like if it's like if it's an argument, it'll probably be about me. <laughs> <laughs> like I would be the problem.、Yeah. You know. And I have, I would have to change. <laughs> It's so hard to change, though. Yeah, but like any argument, I feel like it'll just be about me. But would you like? Do you think you would?、Um, so you got in an argument.、Mm-hmm. Do you think you you would like one?、Um, just take time to sink in、mm-hmm. and like cool off before you like start talking again.、Mm-hmm. Or would you like? Instantly try to solve the problem there. Well, I don't think I can instantly try to solve the problem because I don't think I'm smart enough to do that. So, what would you do? Would you would you freeze and like would you like kind of like go、yeah. outside? Or no, I'll just be like, okay, I'm like trying to listen,、uh-huh. and then I'll just listen to the whole story、uh-huh. of why they're so mad. <laughs> I'm an ENFP.、Oh, you're an ENFP,、mm-hmm. right? You'll be like, "Why are they so mad? They have something stuck in their teeth. They have something stuck in their teeth." Now be so focused on that while they talk about their story of why they're so mad at me. Yeah, you know. So I'll be listening into them, and after they're done, I'll like try to think of like you know. Like on the spot, my response. Actually, or would you say, yeah, like, on the spot? Like I would、um, be like, okay, this is how I feel, you know. So you're you are an on the spot person. Yeah, that's true. Like, but like I I would have to listen to that whole、uh-huh. story first,、right. <laughs> you know, in order to like really think of like my responses,、right. because they're mad, you know. Yeah, they're mad. They're like angry at you. Yeah, it's、reason. really scary. I feel like for me, when someone becomes really like, or、mad、if they have、you? like an argument, or like yeah, so um, they get really mad and like, um, I kind of freeze. Yeah, yeah, I freeze. Like when they raise their tone and their voice,、mm-hmm. I like shut down instantly. Yeah, that's like never happened to me before. <laughs> Maybe <she's> mom. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But like I feel like it's but really mom. Yeah, <laughs> we have some trauma.、Here. Yeah, we have a lot of like mom trauma, mother trauma. Like it's really great that she doesn't really like understand so much of English. <laughs> <Just kidding>. Yeah, <laughs> maybe she won't be like watching this either. But yeah, I, I like kind of shut down. Like I can't hear anything. So I really. I would really, yeah, cause that's scary. Yeah, that's really scary. I would enjoy someone if they were like really calm. Yeah, and like kind of try to like figure things out together. Uh huh. Like I, yeah, I would need a calm person. Yeah, I need a calm. Yeah,、person. cause like I'm like the least calm person. <laughs> I know. I know. Yeah, I know you're really not calm. Yeah, I'm like, and I and I know that. Yeah. Yeah.、Mm-hmm. So I would definitely need a calm conversation. I I I. If like that person is like hysterically mad at me, I think I'll start like laughing. <laughs> I would be like, "Wait, that's really bad. It's really bad." Like that's what I used to do. Like um, how I used to react、uh-huh. when like um like a manager、uh-huh. is like like 
saying a lot of stuff like criticizing me a lot in like a japanese company i would be like huh? <laughs> oh my god this is so funny you know yeah. they're like so mad yeah but then i would just be like it's just so funny it's just so funny yeah but i feel like it's kind of different when like someone you love is like kind of mad at you yeah that's true i will have to experience that i don't really know yeah so yeah yeah i would i wouldn't really know like that that like i think like one of the one like one of like the main reasons i don't want to go into a relationship or anything or like Mm -hmm. i've also always hesitated is like i always see the ending what is the ending like like as in like the relationship ends or you see like oh the relationship (laughs) ends i'm like oh this is probably gonna end so i wouldn't like go into it like really yeah i always see the end like all of sorry but like all of your other past relationships i all i've always seen the end so i was like well like you know like but i I would never i would never tell you right yeah yeah but like i would always i would always talk to mom it's like yeah i see the end of it already fortune teller yeah i always see the end of it but then like i think she's having a lot of fun right now and she's like figuring stuff out Mm -hmm. so like but it's probably gonna end soon but we'll like wait and see kind of i would always have that conversation with mom yeah um but yeah for like any kind of like thing i always gossiping about me (laughs) I always see the end. Yeah. So I'm, I'm just like, I don't think it's like, it's like worth it. But I, yeah. But if I, you know, it's like, oh, like if I see someone, it's like, oh, this might, this person mm-hmm. might be good. I think if I just like go through everything mm-hmm. and I was like, and then it ends. So, like, oh yeah, it, it like, ends. Like, why do, why does it end? Like, what, what makes you think that way? Um, It's just like, you're Every like your values, like everything, your uh-huh. I think it's just like the vibes of it. Uh huh. Yeah, I mean your second relationship, like, um, yeah, I always thought. It was <laughs> that I think one it's just like the vibes. Like four and a half. Yeah, years, I, but. yeah. But like going into like marriage is another story. Yeah. Right. It's another like level of like trust. So like I feel like there's like two types of loves, like love that's like kind of it gets sparked Mm -hmm. and then like um you get into like a boyfriend girlfriend relationship and like you guys always celebrate your anniversaries and like stuff and then there's another type like when you go into marriage it's Uh like you have to build you have to start building a family right yeah and you guys have to like yeah (laughs) yeah and then you have to also like you have to um like you have to be able to work with that person to have a happy life right you know so those are really two different things like one is kind of like it can be like a summer fling Mm -hmm. you know and then another one's like serious shit yeah yeah it's like you're gonna be paying your mortgage together like you're it's like you know so it's like really different so like how if you see marriage as like you know like oh um like, like a continuation of yeah, your relationship of your relationship with your boyfriend uh-huh. is i think it's that's really difficult but if yeah. you see marriage as marriage and like try to look for that person who you can marry and like yeah. have a good relationship forever yeah because like you're gonna be old and you're gonna like you still want to be holding hands yeah you know you, you don't want to be old and like living in like separate beds yeah so right. what would what would your like um like what do you need for a marriage like for you i think it's like um just like your common beliefs about like different things or like Mm -hmm. values need to be like but that's like a continuation of like your relationship yeah so like it's just like if you if you if you just feel really really comfortable Um. with that person you know like really comfortable as like you can like fighting is like a beautiful thing yeah, you know i love fights. yeah <laughs> fights are good like yeah fights are good like so like if you are afraid of like having a fight with that person like that's probably gonna end soon yeah like i feel like um f- fighting is good because it really like it's like a time for you to it's a opportunity for change yeah 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 you know? and to really understand yourself and that person yeah yeah yeah. And then you, after, like, fighting, you actually get to a next level of, like, intimacy mm-hmm. or, like, relationship. And then you guys become better friends. I don't like someone who, like, tries to avoid the fight. 
yeah. or the avoid the talk. Yeah, you like know? confrontation, yeah. right? Confronting Literally, that Literally, that's like, oh, they're like, oh, I don't want to do that because like that's a waste of time or that's a waste of energy or like I don't have the energy to do that right now. But like that is the end, you know? Yeah, that is. Because that yeah. means that they don't want to like grow with you. Yeah. So I feel so. like yeah, being able to like – like confront each other yeah. and still have a good relationship. Like those of the t- those are the That's types true. of like relationships that you want to have, even with a friend. Yeah. Like even with a friend. Like if you're like afraid of like having a fight with that person and then like having the relationship like crumble into pieces, mm-hmm. then maybe you don't trust each other enough. Mm-hmm. I think. So that's why I only have like really a few like n- like few people yeah. like handful of like good friends. That's true. Yeah. Um. Because like, yeah. Because I think like having that kind of relationship with a lot of people is actually really difficult. It's like not realistic. Mm-hmm. I think. So like having a few people that you really trust, and if, even if you get into like a fight or something, like you are, like you still believe. Yeah. That relationship will continue forever yeah you know i think like those are like the types of relationships that that we should all be looking for Mm -hmm. and if it doesn't work out like it's okay and i feel like a lot of my friends um kind of like have this oh i like i don't know like i want to break up but i feel so bad blah 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 Mm -hmm. there's so many friends that come up to me like i i have this problem what should i do and i'm like i I think you should break up like yesterday (laughs) I know. <laughs> like I've ha- I've helped so many people, like friends, break up with their know, she's loved like ones, literally. Yeah, and then they become happier because they prioritize themselves yeah. more, and then like they are like happy or like yeah, they are more confident, and mm-hmm. then they can work on themselves until they find a new relationship like a person that they really like yeah you know and that's just like a journey i feel like i've just Mm -hmm. never had you know a person that i liked yeah yeah so like i never go through that interesting but um i but i think that's like how it is yeah like relationships you know yeah so i think it's like really bad to hang on to like a weird relationship i think you'll be more liberated and more free if you just let go and it's like it's okay like yeah. having an abundant mindset is so important right yeah because because yeah. there's a bomb yeah because you have like 80 billion people yeah. in this whole wide world everyone boom 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 yeah there's 80 billion yeah right 80 billion yeah. i don't know but yeah it seems right Eight billion i don't know i have no idea but, actually yeah i feel like you come first is like the best like I feel like you should always come first, even though that sounds really selfish. Yeah, but you. Um, but your so mental and your physical health is so much more important than the other person's mm-hmm. mental and physical health. Because if your mental and physical health like degrades, you can't love anyone. You can't do your life. Like you can't do anything. Yeah. So taking care of yourself first. Yeah. Is number one. Yeah, definitely. Mm -hmm. And I feel like um, in order to, like, make this world more peaceful, you know, Mm -hmm. you can't be having little, you know, like, little, like, feelings of grudge or, like, anger. That's, like, really bad. And that's also wasting time. Yeah, and your energy. energy. And then you can be doing so much, like, for the world. Yeah. Like, while you're, like, in that shit bomb, you know? Like, there's so many things that you can be doing. I feel like love is just, like, a plus, you know, to your life. Yeah. It shouldn't be, like, like the main thing. The main thing in life. Yeah. Because that's, like, not really the goal. Like, the goal for everyone is to become happy. Yeah. Right? To, like, be happy. Mm -hmm. But, like, if you make, like, love and, like, relationships and, like, your boyfriend, girlfriend, like, your center. Yeah. Like, like your center is gone when that person is gone. It's like yeah. you you lose yourself when that person's gone. Yeah, and so then you're just like um, you're left with yourself. You're yeah, you're just like left with the shell of yourself. Like you don't really have anything inside of you that's going to like make you happy. Yeah. You know, if if that if like people are making you happy, yeah. you have to make yourself yeah happy. You know, mm-hmm. in order to like. In order to like actually do anything, yeah, yeah. So like, I feel like love and like um like having 
um, or like loving someone is like actually a practice of like loving yourself too. Yeah. You know, and like loving others. That's and true. yeah. And also like loving like the fact that we're like living and I don't know. Like it, cause it makes you happy. I feel like, yeah. I feel like loving yourself comes first though before yeah. you can love anyone. Yeah. But if you like, if you really have a hard time loving yourself, yeah. <laughs> you know, you can, um, like people like That's practice true. through you know loving other people and that makes yeah. them happy but like for like me i love myself mm-hmm. i think so like i don't really need to practice <laughs> just kidding loving is like a service of like giving you know practice of giving yeah it's never receiving yeah is what i learned yeah that's true so like when i see you i think it's like really cool like you try to do stuff for other people yeah like you i'm like oh wow like you you know like you like buy donuts for another person because Mm -hmm. like you remember that they like the specific type of donuts Mm -hmm. you know that's like really nice yeah thank you yeah i wouldn't do that i try to yeah um but i would be like uh maybe they don't like it (laughs) (laughs) overthinking it was like oh maybe they were just telling me that they didn't like it so i wouldn't buy it for them you know yeah even like birthday presents are really hard for me oh yeah they're really hard though yeah like i think my love language is definitely not like presents and gifts yeah it's more of like acts of service Mm -hmm. or something quality time yeah quality acts of service i'm kind of quality time so i would definitely yeah i would definitely i love quality time Mm. like i i'm really bad at texting yeah it hurts my eyes it hurts my eyes it's like it hurts read. my fingers yeah so definitely. i'd rather just call or like meet them in person you know yeah that's true yeah but mm. in all love is about giving <laughs> <laughs> what yeah that's true yeah so i'm not really sure but i hope like i find love in like the next few years so yeah, I hope so too so um i wouldn't be stuck with like a dog and me and like eating oatmeal every day by myself for i'm the rest like of so my interested life. to see like how you would react to like having a boyfriend yeah like a day with the day or, i meet the person yeah, right? yeah, yeah. i'm really excited to like and how you would change because like i feel like relationships like really change me every time oh like, really? every time i go into a relationship i become like a better person oh that's really good i, I would like to become a better person yeah and like i feel like my values kind of like change too mm-hmm. so i really like to be in relationships oh that's good mm-hmm. i think that's really cool like being but, in a relationship yeah so i'm really excited to see like how you evolve in a relationship mm-hmm. and like um like what kind of person makes you happy yeah you know what kind of person like i've never seen this person before yeah because, like, me either because she she doesn't easily love people mm-hmm. or like people yeah so yeah i would be really excited to see that person yeah all right um, i hope um do you have any like last takeaways yuka um <laughs> oh yeah we wrote we have a little cheat sheet so we don't forget because we always forget our conclusion i don't know why <laughs> i don't have a boyfriend that's our conclusion <laughs> we don't know why misa does not have a boyfriend yet um you have to <laughs> you have to be arrogant love, love is, is really beautiful, beautiful but you don't have to be in a relationship to explore love Love can be experienced in other ways, like friends. You come first. Your mental and physical health. Your career. And your life. Yes. And just all in all, I don't know why I don't have a boyfriend. So <laughs> <laughs> so we'll update you guys on um, yeah, Misa's like, when... love thing. If it ever happens in like, yeah, the next should, like, few You years. should go on a date with someone. Oh, yeah. You have to do that, like right? Yep. Yeah. <laughs> and you have to like, you have to do that <laughs> before order, marriage, order. before getting kids like you actually have to like go on dates yeah yeah that's so funny i would not do that 
That's a really good idea. Yeah, I would not do that. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm so excited to for you to go on a date with someone. Yeah, I would not do that. Yeah, that's like that's like something like I forget. Like, oh yeah, shoot, you have to go on dates. Yeah, you have to in talk order to, to people, like. Misa. Yeah, you have to talk to people, and you have to get out of this like room. You know. Yeah. Like you can't be like, you can't be laying in bed all day. You don't do that. Yeah, I don't do that. But like you, you're you, always so busy. Yeah, you can't be like you have to go on dates. But so, uh, yeah, that's like just like out of my mind. You know, like on my to do yeah. this to do list, like that is just like not there. It's okay. Yeah, it's okay. I don't, I don't. I don't really focus on that. So, yay! This yeah, is we our... should do like more relationship talks. Yeah, this is really funny. Funny. Yeah, we should do on like once I get a boyfriend in like probably five years. Yeah. Um, that's what I'm planning. So I hope like my plan goes out really well. Yeah. 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 This is a successful podcast. <laughs> we have our takeaway. I don't know why I don't have a boyfriend. We. I hope you guys kind of enjoyed this video yes. podcast. Um, I think we should actually start a podcast, but I don't know. We'll just like we'll just see what yeah you know what's in for us. So okay, so I hope you guys are having a great day and a great life, and I'll see you guys in our next video. Bye. Bye. See you. Go on dates, everyone.